<laughs> Robin. You want to do one of these uh, sex advice things while um, Dee Dee's in the studio? Ooh. Sure. Sue Johansson. Oh, oh, Dr. Sue Johansson from Oxygen Channel. She's a trip. Oh, you know her? Yes. You like she her? She plays with like those two dolls, the blue doll and the red doll. The uh, blue doll's for the boy, the red doll's for the girl. Really? She like does these positions. She's a, Ugh. she's a trip. Yeah. I've only, uh, I, I've only heard clips of her. I haven't oh seen the show. Oh my god, Oxygen Channel. Yeah, I don't even know what that is. It's I'm, hilarious. Like, cable provider. It's not supposed to be hilarious though, right is it? Right next to the it's soap funny sales because channel. She, and... she told one guy, oh, I'll save it. Oh no, what happened? Okay, one day she this guy it, called up it. about butt plugs, and she said, "Try it while you're vacuuming." <laughs> <laughs> she told <him. laughs> I just thought that was funny. That's terrific. What? Yeah. That's terrific. That's terrific. <laughs> she told the guy to just try it out while he was vacuuming. You sure he, she wasn't talking about butt plug removal? No, she... Oh, <laughs> try the vacuum. <laughs> no, she say just try it out while you're vacuuming. Mm -hmm. You may like it. <laughs> uh, that's funny. I'm funny. <laughs> 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 and you love this show, huh? Maybe it's, it's for women. You know what? It's funny. I think it's I hilarious. Think it oh, I would like to get through and nothing. ask her, I don't know, come what up with this. What would you want to ask I her? Don't know, we... Yeah, what would you ask Sue Johansson? I think you do know. The I grandma know, that gives no. out sex advice. I don't know what I would ask her, but it would be fun to get through to her and just make up something. Mm. Well, what would you make up? I'm sure if you're on the phone, you'd have to think on the fly. You've thought about this. No, I haven't. Yes, you have. No, I haven't. You should do sex advice with Dee Dee. <laughs> It's not a bad idea. Dee Dee's a pervert. Dee Dee is a little I'm not a pervert, filthy just pervert. Just because I get like the whip. That you like to be whipped and have nipple clamps and cock rings. You are a filthy girl. You're yeah. a dirty okay, girl. Okay, and who has hookers? Oh, I'm awful. Yeah. I know I'm awful. I love these two, man. There's something going on here. I know. Dee Dee. Actually, somebody did send me an email. I have to forward it to you guys because yeah. he photoshopped mine in his. Really? Really? Yeah. Of you two going at it? Well, like we're getting married or something in a private room. See, you guys, you two definitely live in the same world. Yes, we do. And you yeah. both know it. That's what I love about what I see going on here. But she, she I don't think there's any. I don't think there's any real attraction here. But you could. Both, oh, she, I know what you guys want. You, you I know what Dee wants. You guys can relate to each other. What I do I want? Uh, Dee wants a good uh, bottom redney. <laughs> yeah. She knows how to redden her bottom properly. <laughs> she knows it. She, of course she knows it. How could she not know it? Likes getting that ass slapped. Of course she does. But not by everybody. Oh, I know oh, that, but no. she understands that spank her properly. Dee Dee definitely that. understands Would that. Would you let Jimmy spank Ooh. you properly? She under, no, she understands what I would do. I'd slide the panties down a little bit. You know, you spank, and then you, no, you just yeah. make sure. You have to, this is what you do, and you, you park the thighs a little bit gently, and you make sure the person's <laughs> not getting wet. If the person's getting wet, you spank them harder because... Oh, <laughs> that's not that's absolutely. a no-no. Absolutely, and they know they're not supposed to get wet, and they get wetter. It's just it's a reality. <laughs> wow, of Jimmy. Maybe wow. you slap the... You know, He's the, into it. You know he is, because he knows a lot about it. That's the truth. You make sure that you tell them, do not do not get, you know... And that makes them get... Wetter, right, Dee? Of course, does. <laughs> pull the, you pull the Look panties her, she's, tight. She's trying to fan herself right now. And just... But he, she knows it's true that you hold the panties. The first panties, you pull them tight between the lips. Not too hard, just a little bit of pressure, you know? Is that true, Dee? Of course it's true. Sure. Oh, stupid Regis. I guess the winner of the contender is on. Yeah. So Regis comes out with the boxing robe on and, oh. and the boxing gloves. Oh, there's the guy And now the he's going to duke it out with him a little bit. Uh huh. Oh, sorry. The, oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> the guy with the crane. <laughs> That's, the That's a research lab <laughs> that they're testing out things on a chimpanzee. Oh. <laughs> I, I just looked at the other TV. Well, when you look uh, fast, <laughs> look at the what can I tell you? Thing they just I All just right. want to see Regis get his ass kicked. All right. Well, uh, well, we can play a clip from Sue Johansson here, Anthony. Talk sex with Sue Johansson. It's on the Oxygen mm. Channel. She's a grandma, and she's just awful with her advice. But Dee Dee seems to like you it. You gotta watch her. It's seeing her do play with the dolls. All right. Let's listen to this uh, bit of advice. Hey. Hi. What's up? Hi, Brianna. How are you? Oh, I'm fine. Good. You got a uh, question? Yes. Um, I'm 18 years old. Yeah. And I've just noticed I'm hornier than a lot of my friends. Is this normal? And is it okay to masturbate with baby oil? <laughs> yep. Yes and yes. Okay, now, <laughs> masturbation for females, I mean, you're 18. <laughs> I'm sorry it took you 18 years to learn how to do it, but... No, I did it a long time ago. <laughs> what, what did she get the idea that she did, it took her that long? She just said she's 18 and she masturbates. Didn't say I just started. She's that. She has that owl disease. Yeah, <laughs> owl's disease. She's got the owl's disease. Oh, Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's. Right. Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's. Whatever. Alt 
I'm saying it fast now. Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's? Oh, okay, say it. It's alt. Alzheimer's. Whatever. Yeah, yeah that's exactly alt. it. All right. Okay. Oh, I did it a long time ago. <laughs> okay, well then that's good. It's fine. Now, when you masturbate, do you pleasure yourself? Do you reach orgasm? Yes. Oh, good. All right. Ooh. That's real good. Now, and you're worried about what? <laughs> I'm sorry. That might get sick if I use baby oil because I'm too oh. ashamed to go buy the regular stuff. Now, you know what? Baby, the trouble with baby oil is that it has perfume in it, you know? It smells nice. And baby oil, uh, can you can get some women develop an allergic reaction to the baby oil yeah. because it's got the perfume mm -hmm. in it. So why don't you go to any drugstore, any drugstore at all, and pick up a bottle of ordinary garden variety lubricant. lubricant. They're not that expensive. Lubricant. They'll last you forever and ever. And you just open the top up and squish them on your hands and use that for lubrication Ugh. rather than baby oil. Baby oil smells nice, but that's a problem because it's got perfume. Okay, Brianna? Good. I'm glad we got your call in because that was obviously something that was worrying you. That is awful advice. She's got, she it's said obvious. she's embarrassed. It's obvious advice. Yeah. Dee Dee? It wasn't bad advice. The girl was afraid. To, you know, she was embarrassed. And... She doesn't want to go to the drugstore, though, and pick up lube. That's why she uses the baby oil. She just needs to get over that and go get... And it all depends if she's still living at, her, at home... With the parents, you can't have uh, KY around the, in your house. <laughs> if there's baby it. oil around, then, you know, it's baby oil. It could be used for anything. Right. You know. Uh, yeah, yeah, but the yeah. perfume thing is a good point, though. Oh, really? Yeah, people can be allergic to perfumes. Yeah. So what? They perfumes. Radio stations. <laughs> perfumes. Millions. No, you're right. That, I mean, because perfumes have definitely... <laughs> perfumes. Oh, God! I, mean, she, I, she, I actually agree with you. You're absolutely right. Because a lot of times, unscented things are fine, but if you're going to put perfumes in something, then you do, absolutely should just put the accent wherever you feel it goes. Yeah. The way the rest of the country pronounces something is irrelevant. You know? I can't help it. Sorry. What do you, what, I say talk it again. different. You, no, you don't. You, I'm you, secure with my speech impediment now, man. Absolutely. You're, you guys should, you should, you guys should have the kids Your together. Your tongue's a mess. Are you going to put perfumes in? <laughs> what? Perfume. Perfume. <laughs> yeah. What? You right. sound like a cartoon speeding by boys. Fume. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to Doug out Doug from Whack Bag. What's up, Doug? Good Hi, Doug. Morning, Good morning, fellas. Hi, Good Doug. morning, Dee Dee. Dee Dee. Good morning, I Doug. I love you. I love your show. I am my kid's mom. I have a question for you. <laughs> for me or for them? I have a question for you, Dee Dee. I have a sex advice question for you. Oh, okay. Oh, God. <laughs> well, you see, um... Due to the increased sensitivity during the menstrual cycle, I do enjoy very much crime scene sex. Um, during that time, usually when you pull out, you get like a flaky consistency mixed with blood chunks. And this last time when I was doing it, when I pulled out, it was more like a blood-soaked rice pudding. Ew. Oh, God. <laughs> That's just wrong. I was wondering if that was quite possibly uh, a yeast infection at the same time. Oh, good question. I don't know. Ew. Did you into the crime scene sex? No. Ew. Good girl. Ew. Where you have to put a tarp down? No. No? Yuck. Yuck. Not I will not do it while I'm sheets. on my Aunt Flo. No. You, you don't huh? need that all over Aunt satin Aunt sheets, right? No. Yeah. <laughs> no, no have sex, get yeah. the so, so what do you do when you're having your flow? Well, duh, anal probably. Uh, <laughs> of course. <laughs> well, of course. Well, of course. Wow. Oh, my God. <laughs> Most people say Stupid nothing. Stupid me, right? Yeah. I just take my all and relax. <laughs> but apparently, you know, the, the asshole store is open. Well, <laughs> if, if, if I'm with a guy and he really, really wants something, well, that's all of he's going to get while do I'm the anal. Flow. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, D.D. That must be a lovely scene. <laughs> wow. Blood dripping. <laughs> like we're just, just hanging the back hanging door. No, because oh. if you have a tampon on, it's not going to drip. You're right. All right. Well, well you're right. Well. So I'm just letting you know it's not going to drip. You, you know, know I have to. Uh, I just picture if you if you flip over on your belly and, and your your most intimate is, is kind of laying there on the sheets. Oh. Uh, bleeding? Does it look like a boxer freshly knocked out? <laughs> like you know how the mouth kind of is open a little, and the little blood is coming out. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> look down there. And, and sometimes the, the cut man does, you know, throw some cotton and stuff in the yeah, mouth. Yeah, that's to, true. To stop okay. the bleeding. Yeah. Some of that cotton <laughs> starts hanging out a little bit. <laughs> you're there with your face in the pillow, your keister up in the air. Oh, nice. <laughs> keister. <laughs> I found myself recently in a supermarket uh, in the tampon section, and uh, man, you guys, you girls have a lot of choices for tampons, yeah. I noticed. Yeah. I got to come in with uh, the list of uh, the choices for you girls. Mm. You want There's... me to go through the list? Oh, you know the list? I don't know. Okay. I know there was Kotex, one. That... No, 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 no. There's there, But there were certain ones like Gentle Glide. Oh, yeah. The plastic Gentle Glide. <laughs> Why? Wouldn't your choices end there if you're a woman and you, you're looking for a, a, a tampon? You want it to be gentle and to glide. You want it gentle and, yeah, you want it to glide in nice. Yeah. What other choices idea. could there what? possibly be that are going to beat out the Gentle Glide? Yeah, what's another popular cell? The, the Sandpaper Fish Hook? <laughs> 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 no, there's just like there's cardboard ones too, which why they still make them. I don't know. It looks like a push up, but they one have the push up pop thing. <laughs> yeah. It does. Yeah, big <laughs> cardboard tube. But they they have those marketing words. I I'll, I'll have to do my research over the weekend, and I'll come in with a whole list. You do we'll that research again. that over this weekend, Opie. Well, gentle just because glide. some of them were hilarious, I can't remember anymore. But one was gentle glide, and I'm thinking if you're a woman, Playtex, that's I think yeah. But what are some of the other ones? There's like extra. There's like extra crispy. Yeah. <laughs> no, you mean for the different like like if you're moderate, if you're heavy, it's stuff oh like that. Oh my god, dude! It was. It <laughs> was, was like. It was. There's a lot. There's. It made me um, dizzy. It's, yeah. You what? think there's a lot of choices for cereal in the supermarket these days? <laughs> oh my god! There's wings too on the uh, on the pads. On the, pad. <laughs> the wings they wrap around the panties and keep them from flowing over the edge. Oh, is that what that wings mean? Yeah. I never investigated that. Oh sure, you put the you lay the pad in the panty, and then the wings like stick underneath, kind of oh, on the side, okay. so no leakage spills on the side. Well, now what? Let me ask. You were saying heavy. What do they give you with a heavy flow? It's, it's like it's a just certain. It's a larger tampon. Does it come with like a, a little string and a needle? Not a string. <laughs> oh god. A little thread. I just think it's funny that you're talking about wings. <laughs> wings flying on the wings of a maxi. <laughs> Mm, sew it up. Looks like a catcher's mitt. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever allowed a guy Freshly to get stuffed turkey? <laughs> oh God! Have what? you ever allowed a guy to get his red wings? Mm. No, I no? know what. The, no. Goes down on you. It looks like he's been drinking grape juice. Oh. <laughs> no, I, I, God. I told you I don't like that when I no no, no when <laughs> Amplos visiting no. Or it looks like he st no. <laughs> stuck his face in a cherry pie. Oh God! You look like a victim of the Jonestown massacre. <laughs> <laughs> You're just laying there, drugged out, with <laughs> Kool Aid on your face. <laughs> no, no. Mm -mm. Oh. And you'd prefer to be one? <laughs> <laughs> no, you'd rather no, just flip it over. No, that's one thing I've never done, and I probably won't. All wow, right. never let a guy do it during that. No. I don't blame you. Good for but you. You'll roll over on your belly. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wow. Someone has a very good question for Dee Dee. Oh let, me, God. let me go to, uh, let's see, Andy in New York City. Hi, Andy. 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 Yeah, Andy. Andy. Good morning, boys. Hey. How, how are you, sweet, sweet tits? Hi, mister. Let's, let's, not, let's keep the uh, insults out. I'm sorry. Dee Dee, right. I have a sex question for you. I was wondering if... You like the trifecta, the going from the front to the rear, right to the mouth. Oh, good question. Didi, are you into the ass to mouth? The trifecta. <laughs> no. You don't do ass to mouth? No. No, if it's down no, there. No, it's a little weird. It's got to be cleaned off before, you know. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. <laughs> it's got to go from, it's gotta go from uh, the reverse. you got to start with the mouth, um, then vag, then the back door. Right. No, nah, Didi, if you do it the other way. God, it's it's Jimmy. Out. Yeah, you're right. I'm saying for hygienic purposes. Right. Ah, but if, go if, in if the you shower. do it the original, if you do it the original way, you call it the triple crown. I'm not saying you're wrong in theory, sir. I'm not. I'm not saying the humiliation factor isn't sexy and hilarious. <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying. Like <laughs> Punch now, boys. Bye, right, Mister. Very nice. Let's go to Michigan. Brian, what's up? Hey, hey fellas. Hey, hey. Love the show. Hey, oh, thank you. Hi, fella. Hey, uh, we call that a chili dog. When you go from the ass, oh, from the ass to the mouth, that's what we refer to as a chili Most. dog. A buddy of mine's got a girl that that's just loves that. disgusting. What's a chili dog, exactly? Oh, well, you put it in her backside, and then you pull it out and put it in her mouth. Right. Ugh. <laughs> and put it in her mouth. Put it in Can you not say it? You, you got a that? mission from God? That's <laughs> awful. A mission from God. <laughs> and then you so put like it him. in the mouth. You put it in her mouth. <laughs> the Sisters of Mercy. <laughs> Uh, yeah. How you do it? Oh. 
All right, one more here, and then we go. We'll go back to Sue Johansson. Mm-hmm. Ben in uh, uh, Penn, Jesus. Uh, ben in uh, Pennsylvania. Ben. Ben. <laughs> What's up? Where? Hey, um, uh, that that old guy. Who advice. is this? this? <laughs> K S S. What was the who is this? Oh, Adande. Oh, right, right. Adande. Adande. Go ahead, Ben. Hey, uh, that old brother was giving the advice. Did she actually ask that girl if she masturbates to go to orgasm? Who on planet Earth doesn't masturbate to go to orgasm? <laughs> Oh, my exactly. God. You'll spend the whole afternoon until you uh, reach your goal. you got to finish yeah. up. Punch it out. All right. You'll be chafed beyond uh, recognition as yeah. long as you get to the end there. All right. Let's, uh, let's uh, do another one from Sue Johansson. The magical sperm she talks about here, Ooh, Anthony. Magical. Magical. Yes. Uh, my husband tells me that um, sperm is good for my hair. <laughs> is this true? <laughs> Samantha. Yes. Yeah. No. It's not. No. You know what? That's the first time I've ever heard that line. I have heard a lot of lines about the wonderful fringe. You know what, though? Yeah. We did a whole bit uh, a few years back. There was a shampoo that came out that yep. had sperm in it. That's some kind of sperm. And they claimed that uh, made the shampoo it. better. Yeah. What the hell was the name of that shampoo? It was legit and everything. Bob? <laughs> 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 oh, man, we had fun with that, remember? Mm. All right, whatever. Let's go back. About the wonderful fringe benefits of ejaculate. And one of them is that if you rub it on your face, it'll clear up your acne. Ew. If you swallow it, it'll give you big boobs. <laughs> I have heard that if you swallow it, it will eliminate menstrual cramps. Make you a good girl. I have heard that <laughs> it's, it's diet food. Because there's only 35 calories in one teaspoon, but I have never heard that it'll make your hair shine and look lustrous. Otherwise, you know what? Our pubic hair would be, oh, just goose me. I don't think so, Samantha. All right, thank you. Nice try, though. Shut up. You gotta right. give, you've got to give him credit for, uh, for innovation, all right? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Well, Thank the, you. Goodbye. Bye-bye. That's the jack in her hair. <laughs> he probably shot at her hair and she complained and he went, ah, yeah. it's good for your hair. Don't worry. It's fine. No, I heard one thing. I don't know if it's true. I heard that there's like protein in it. Yes, and that's it's true. it's good for, like when you do swallow it. That's what I was oh. told a long time ago. Do you? Yeah. I don't know if that's true or not. What do you do with it? Yeah, what? You spit? <laughs> No, you swallowed. No. She obviously swallowed. Well, I have to know the guy to Oh, swallow. please. Oh, yeah. stop. Seriously. If you don't know him, what do you just spit it back in his face? <laughs> right out the car window? <laughs> I don't, yeah. I, it's only you, with certain guys I would do that. Only one. certain guys? <laughs> do you, uh, only certain, you ever, like, hang out and spit out the window and almost get your head cut off by some random cable? <laughs> no. Oh. Do you take it on the face? I'm not going to answer that. No. That's a yes. Oh, that's no. a yes. It's he either no. no. You fell right yes. into our trap. That's a yes. When uh, Whenever anyone says, I'm not going to answer that, that means the answer is yes. No. Right. I'll bet you Dee Dee likes to have like a man uh, getting ready to finish and the kind of her arms being pinned down by her side while he straddles her shoulders Ooh. and chest. So you have that feeling of helplessness, and then he just kind of gives it to you. God damn, he's good. Yeah, you guys wow. live in the same world. I'm going to say it again. I, I, I see it. It's so obvious. Because you're nodding like, yeah, yeah, exactly, well, Jim, right. exactly. I'm like, holy shit. You got those cute glasses on. You ever let a guy finish on the glasses Ew. and then you're like, oh, I can't see, I can't see. I don't see. wear glasses <laughs> while I'm having sex. A little oh. bukkake. <laughs> <laughs> Pukake. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Oh, All right, well, now we have, uh, this is a very interesting contrast we have going yeah. on today. We have the sex advice from the Grandma Sue Johansson, and then we got our callers calling in to ask Dee Dee sex questions. <laughs> Todd, what's up? Hey, hey, Dee Dee. Hi. Hey, guys, how you doing? Good. Uh, I wanted to ask Dee Dee uh, if there's anything <laughs> special that she does to uh, prepare herself for an evening of anal pleasures. <laughs> Dee, Dee That's a very good question. It certainly is. Do you prep for anal? Mm-hmm. Anima? Well, so it's not a store? Yeah, sure. I guess, yeah. Toy? You start with a toy? Yeah, what, what, what kind of stuff do you do? Yeah. <laughs> how do you prep? Yeah, how do you prep for the anal there, Dee, Dee? I can't. You know you're going to have anal tonight. What do you do that's <laughs> a little special? God. What do you do besides you turn every family photo around, around backwards? <laughs> <laughs> You stay away from White Castle for a couple days. I mean, what, no. what do you do? That's all you need is sliders in your pubes. <laughs> Jesus. 
<laughs> Your crotch smells like a drunk's car at four in the morning on a Saturday. Well, I don't know if I do anything special. It's just it's like there's a burger place in New York. We've talked about it, I guess. But uh, what the oh, hell is God. the name of it? These burgers don't last more than twenty minutes in you. Oh know? God! And the they're the best burgers ever. They're they're all over uh, Manhattan. Greece, like like in Jersey, it's the White Rose system. It's called. It's like just like those awful <laughs> these things. You st you you Jackson Hole Jackson though. Hole burgers. Yeah. Thanks, Ed. And uh, you take that first bite, and you just feel your stomach already percolating. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, Bwah. But they're great, right? They're, they're amazing. And I always, the first time I went in there, I wondered why there was a line for the bathroom. Oh. <laughs> and I found out. They're actually handing you burgers while you're shitting. <laughs> right. There you go. <laughs> Chew, swallow. <laughs> I mean, White Castle's pretty bad, but these Jackson Hole burgers, they're, you, yeah. you can get them like 200 different ways. They have every version of the burger imaginable, and these things do not stay in mm -hmm. you whatsoever. But anyway, back to Dee Dee. Dee Dee? How do you prepare the uh, the back door for the anal? You mean yeah. so I'm like know it's coming? Uh, mentally, physically, mentally, you clean up. You well, try to you try to think uh, it isn't possible I'm that dead relatives clean. are watching you. <laughs> what? That what? You don't think of your grandparents the, or anybody watching else? you. I've always thought of that too. Dropping in from heaven. Oh, yeah. God, Let me I see would... what. Oh Jesus <laughs> yeah. Christ! She's got her face in a pillow. <laughs> oh, no. No, oh, I, I, oh no! Oh <laughs> no! <laughs> My grandma would it's have a heart attack. Weird. <laughs> Weird. Right. Weird. Right. Why is she putting it there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. It doesn't go there. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, I, I'd like to believe that we go somewhere after this life, but, man, if they're looking at us, ugh. I, oh. God, I hope oh, not. Oh, my God. Can you imagine? Well, give my condolences <laughs> to her sphincter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> I was oh. just raising her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you raise them. Come on, Dee Dee. All right, well, just here's so the deal. You're gonna have anal. You don't want the guy using your drapes after he's done. Oh, <laughs> you, you, oh. You, uh, so what do you do? Well, like so, because I get tense a little bit because it does hurt. Of um, <laughs> Ooh, tell us more. <laughs> Jimmy knows. Look, say have to. God, he does it with such a puppy little face. Though. Like you got that cute little puppy dog boy thing, and then you talk about hookers. Oh wow. Well. I'm not talking about um, hookers. I'm just talking about no, regular but you just have this innocence. Never mind. I'm a good boy. Um, so to get me like to be less tense, he'll do a little bit of something first. <laughs> oh. this Mouth and hand, maybe. Finger yeah, of too. Course. And, yeah. Sure. Wow. That kind of loosens start... me up a little bit, and yeah. then I feel okay to. Well, the hand's no, perfect. You start with the pinky and slowly work your way up to the thumb. Yeah, and get a the couple of fists. Like, and like, and like, then you try. You then you get the other fist in there, then you clap, and then you're ready. <laughs> oh, Lord. You so know, yeah. we start like that, so I'll get, like, less tense. You know you're ready when he starts going, in the name of the people in the Senate, wait, the, the, oh. when he, in the name of the Senate, the people of Rome. <laughs> oh, well, God. Up, Proculus. So that's how I get set up for that. All right. Very nice. Yeah, loosen up the area a little bit. Oh, God. A lot of people want to know how many holes you've taken at one time. What? Well, they, what? It, it could, it's either one, two, or three. Let's go. At one time, I am. I'm only usually with one guy. So usually, usually there was usually. one wow. time it was with two guys, and, and that was when I was in my twenties. How was that? Yeah, back in L.A. when I was, of course, still drinking. <laughs> Ooh, that. That's, uh, all right, we're all gonna sit back for yeah, this. Yeah, I'm throwing up a little bit. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. So we're with two guys. Yeah. Well, tell us more. Well. I mean, I, it was my roommate and somebody he knew, and it just kind of happened. It wasn't meant to happen. It just happened. Were you on the rotisserie? <laughs> <laughs> or were you doing... Anthony came up with the best. I forgot what it was, though, Ant. When uh, a girl works to it one time. Oh. <laughs> Wait, was, what did oh, you... the double pump? <laughs> yeah. But yeah. you had some, some kind of... I forgot your analogy. One so of hilarious. them was wor working the tank controls. <laughs> right. <laughs> she, you know, grabbing on one with each hand. <laughs> the tank controls. <laughs> yeah. Working some big rig equipment. Yeah. Working uh, the tank. Some kind of front loader. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. I had two holes there then. Oh, wow. What, uh, uh, mouth? Yeah. And then, uh, wow. Finger cuffs. So, you were on the rotisserie. Yeah. So. Play cards on your back? <laughs> no. Finger cuffs. That'd be good. Yeah, finger cuffs. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Wow. Any more questions? Um, yeah. I mean, uh, <laughs> that's good. Oh, my God. This guy has a great name for crime scene sex. I've never heard it called this before. Let's see. Let's go to Chainsaw the Trucker. Oh, God. Chainsaw. I'm no trucker. 
Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> I was going to tell you, we call that uh, eating a girl on the rag. We call that uh, Ronald McDonald smile. <laughs> 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 Bravo! Oh, brother, that is what it's called now. And how long is it going to take for someone to grab that name for <laughs> Ronald McDonald's mouth? <laughs> there goes another screen name. Uh, there it goes another one. screen name. <laughs> that's oh. hilarious. <laughs> that is very funny. Definitely going to call it that now. Uh, <laughs> Wait, what's this, Steve? Lex and Terry, what? What's I Steve? guess there's audio of Lex and Terry trashing you uh, from today okay, that uh, Eric just put in there. All righty. Oh, that's wonderful. Always good when the uh, Opie and Anthony name is mentioned. All right, we'll find that in a minute or two. Okay. Hope, uh, they said, hope they don't give it to us too hard. <laughs> I don't know if we can handle it. All right, you want an, another um, question for Sue Johansson here? Yeah, let me hear. Yeah. Okay. She discusses the dangers of labiaplasty. What? And labiaplasty is explained. It's probably a surgery for shrinkage. Yeah. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, my wife was curious about labiaplasty. Is it safe and do you lose any sensation? Yes. Why does she want to do this? Uh, is it safe? Does you, Do you lose any sensation? Yes. <laughs> what the hell kind of answer is that, y'all bag? So, so safe you wouldn't believe it. <laughs> is it safe? No, no, very, very dangerous. Safe? Very careful. Very dangerous. <laughs> so safe you wouldn't believe it. <laughs> Enjoy your youth. <laughs> it's the last time no one will expect you to have a tight labia. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, you. my wife was curious about labiaplasty. Is it safe and do you lose any sensation? Yes. Why does she want to do this? Uh, she doesn't like them, says they bother her. Now that uh, she doesn't like them and they bother her, like why do they bother her? Um, I'm thinking just rubbing together, I guess. And even if she has the size of her labia reduced, oh. yeah, they won't rub together. I guess. I don't have them, so I don't no. know. <laughs> I know. Um, I mean, I'd love to talk to her. Yeah, I couldn't get her on the phone. Oh, really? Okay. Use what you cut off let, the right, beef and broccoli. All right, let me just talk her, then. I'll talk <laughs> through uh, you okay. to her. Um, my concern <laughs> is, you know, anytime you make an incision, mm. you make a cut, you kill nerve endings. Yeah. Now, the labia have quite a few nerve endings, and they're very sexually, they're easy to stimulate. Yeah. So if you have this kind of surgery, then um, you're, you've lost that whole rim, ridge, of nerve endings. Okay. That's and what I was concerned about. Yeah. And they, they're not bothering you. No. <laughs> and nobody else can see them. No. So, I mean, I can understand having your nose bobbed or something like that, <laughs> but labia, nobody can see them. Her nose. So. Uh, nobody. Yeah. Hmm. It's not risky surgery, but... Um, this woman's talking out her ass. It will reduce sensations. Okay. So that's the best I can say to you. She's been right, stumped, Anthony. Okay. Yep. All right. Maybe I, we, maybe you can convince her. Thanks a lot. Okay, Joe. Bye bye. Bye bye. This, is, I, can, this is. Go ahead. I guarantee her dumb husband thinks that her lips are too big and wants them to get it reduced. He's probably like, "Why don't you have that surgery?" And she's like, "I don't know." And then he's trying to find out this dummy she's married to is probably doesn't well, like her big Well, perhaps they're ridiculous big. I know you like them big. No but, such thing. You know, if it looks like uh, Bubba from Forrest Gump <laughs> Bubba. down I like that. there, perhaps uh, <laughs> she needs a little clipping. No, she doesn't. Tuck one into each sock and head on over. <laughs> I like that. Uh, this is an awkward time to... Uh, you guys it, talking about labia? Yeah, yeah. this is an awkward yeah. time to introduce our next guest, a good Speaking friend of the show. Of vaginas. Uh, yeah. Jim Gaffigan, everyone. That's, Jim Gaffigan. That's dirty. <laughs> it's really dirty, right? It's so filthy. I, I haven't seen you guys in a long time. It's been a long time, and now it's satellite <laughs> it's radio, so we can talk about the stuff weird. freely and unfettered. You can cuss, but that's sinning. By regulation. That's like sinning, really. Yeah. What I uh, I remember when you guys were off the air, there was like, mm. I would get these emails. Am I not supposed to bring them? No, <laughs> oh, no, no. no I would fine. get these emails. They're like, 
I uh, I control an Opie and Anthony website, and I need a CD to do a fundraiser so that they can get you know like and I'm just like I'd really send people a CD. trying to rip Have you up? Gotten, like when you guys were off the air. It's like we're doing a kind of like this. There was uh, people just the, getting free CDs. From no, you. but it's, there's tons. Of, you know the the O and A fans are pretty. Yeah, you know, I know they're amazing. rabid. We call them our pests. Yeah, they're our pests. <laughs> <laughs> they're pests. <laughs> And uh, they were getting free merchandise off of you. Well, they were they were doing some auction. I don't know. I'm sure it was for a charity or something. I'm sure it was. Something special. Well, yeah. <laughs> well, J Jim, you walked into an interesting situation here. We're, do we're listening to some sex advice from this grandma, Sue Johansson. She does a show on the Oxygen Channel. I watch it every day. Do you? <laughs> yeah. You do, huh? In, when I'm not watching Lifetime. I watch that. I, I, could you th believe oh. they actually made a worse channel than <laughs> Lifetime? <laughs> they made it like Lifetime... To times ten for for just whiny women. Well, Lifetime also they were they tried to do that HBO thing where they're like, we're gonna have Lifetime movies, we're gonna have the Lifetime reality channel. Yeah, a Lifetime exclusive <laughs> series. It's like, oh, who's this guy that beats the wife until she kills him? <laughs> <laughs> it's like the same plot on every show and movie on that. Meredith channel. Baxter Bernie needs yeah. to work. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one you're seeing. starring Meredith Baxter Bernie and Marky Post. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one again. A very special one. Directed by, <laughs> by um, the uh, I can't remember anything. I yeah. smoke a lot it's, of crack. That, uh, and, and, and everything's then, filmed through cheesecloth on that channel. It's got to be all fuzzy, so they look good. Sybil Shepherd. <laughs> <laughs> we need Sybil Shepherd back. Or we need her crazy ass back on the air. Sybil Shepherd and the mother from Family Ties. Lifetime. Meredith Baxter. Bernie. So is so. This is a show on oxygen, and uh, the woman Old lady, gets advice. Grandma, yeah. She's ancient. She's a she's, grandmother. Yeah. She's a grandmother. Yeah, and not even like one of those uh, hot grandmas. Right. Is it where, uh, where you'd find those? I don't know either, but I assume <laughs> people would find grandma hot. But this one, uh, no. We're obsessed with the, in this country. We're obsessed with getting sexual advice from people that we shouldn't be getting it from. Yeah. It's like she's really old. <laughs> <laughs> like, in 1980, she wasn't getting laid. Maybe we should ask her now. That's like yeah. So point. why listen to her? <laughs> what does she does she say? Just this, you know, explicit things. Is that the allure? Oh yeah, that's the whole gimmick. Yeah, she's kind of doing the Doctor Ruth. Uh, Doctor Ruth. But I it's Doctor Ruth. Doctor Ruth never went this yeah, explicit. Yeah. So and then we got Dee Dee. She's a Hi. freak. Hi, Dee Dee. How I'm are you? Not a She's a freak. freak. She likes to be spanked. Would you like to spank Dee Dee? Everyone else. You know has. what? I, my hand. I just was spanking a lot of people <laughs> yeah. earlier. Yeah, so, so you got, a, like you got an injured. Off. You're on the injured reserve right now. Yeah, I'm kind of doing it. I'm doing the non spank. Diet, <laughs> right, so. Well, well, we got whips and everything. She just really. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she can't get. Have enough. you been doing some of that, Jim? You've been doing the spanking. I whipped her. Um, I spanked her yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So she's just kind of like, <laughs> is she part of the team now? Well, when we're down here in Washington, she is. Yeah. She's she always comes in. When we're not here, she does traffic. <laughs> yeah, she's the traffic <laughs> person in Texas. Chicago. <laughs> Chicago too. Minneapolis and. So Dallas. you're on the. Are you the XM channel for uh, traffic on those? You know, like different cities have the traffic thing. Yes. Because hey. people like hearing the voice of a five-year-old telling you if there's a <laughs> we actually, traffic in your area. Uh, yeah, there's <laughs> yeah, a car crash. We actually <laughs> ruined her whole radio career. Cause what, she had a really good gig here at XM. She did something for the kids' channel. She was on XM Kids. I was Kids. A cricket. She was cricket on XM Kids, <laughs> and we blew that one out. <laughs> what would you say as cricket, like on XM Kids? What would be like a line you would say? Just, hey, the Wiggles are coming up. Yay, let's all dance. Woohoo! And the kids would just freak out. They love that oh, voice. Yeah, they love Wiggles. And now it's like, five car pile up. And now she was just explaining how she gets ready for anal. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's another you thing. You can see where there Delicious. might have been a problem yeah. with the XM management. Conflict <laughs> there. <laughs> Conflict of interest. <laughs> where's the kid? Where's that lady from the kids' channel? She got her face in the pillow with her dumper wide open. <laughs> oh, <laughs> God. Lovely. <laughs> so now you know all the players. Enjoy that coffee this morning. <laughs> hey, Jim, could you just uh, take the whip and whip her once for uh, Jim oh. Gaffigan? Come yeah, on, yeah, just yeah. Just so be... everyone knows what's going on here, we want we want Jim Gaffigan right to feel at home here. He's... I have to get the distance right. I'm not this is going to be like this isn't going to be like that Denzel Washington Accord, Academy Award winning role in Glory, where, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where he just wouldn't cry. <laughs> <laughs> She's just not going to cry. Go ahead, do it. I know, but you respect me, but you have to do it. <laughs> oh, the racial issues of this country, how they were in. Legs again, you got the legs. Right, yeah, Jim. Now, this, this arouses you? Not right now, no. Cause Not right now. You're being watched. Because yeah, she's fully clothed. Oh, wow. I, I love how Norton knows what he's doing with a whip. He's like, wow, this is how I do it. Right. Oh, my God. That was my back, too. Uh, that's, that's, you 
Ben yeah. Hovland, you know better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> like hitting you on the back is any less humiliating. <laughs> Not in the back, just the ass. All, I'm all for being <laughs> whipped, the, but... Uh, hold on, I gotta get the, uh... I gotta get the distance right. Yeah, he... The distance... Oh, God! It stings. It does. Okay. Just one more. Look at Norton's eyes. He really <laughs> yeah, it Norton. scares me. The Nazi comes <laughs> out of him. All right, one yeah. more. One more. His eyes do scare me. They freaked me out. Yes. <laughs> Jimmy was trying to tell us he's bleeding. Jimmy one was more. trying to tell us that he's never done this before. That look at his technique. You to, that's gonna teach you to run, boy. <laughs> Get an axe. Half that foot's coming off. Oh, God. <laughs> it's amazing Damn. the impact of Ruth on our lives. It's like... It that was... one? Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, there you that go. Mean, I mean, it's like Roots. It's like you could make a reference to any... You know, like a farm in, like, Tennessee, and you're like, Roots. I remember that. That was the last episode where they bought that... <laughs> yeah. Like, and and the chopping off the foot. That? It's like if someone loses a, a toe, you're like, like on Roots, where he <laughs> could to kindy lost half a foot, but he still could do things. Like, 1976, and we're still referencing. Someone hands it. you water, you have to look through it, make sure there's no saliva <laughs> floating. <laughs> Arthur Haley. Uh, yeah. He was like the to do. Alex Haley. Alex Haley. That was it. Hey, uh, let's throw an X's biography. Yeah, really. Yeah. Let's go to Virginia real fast. Alan? Yeah. What's up? Oh, I just got a term for you for crime scene sex. I don't know if you guys have ever heard it. You ever heard of ahead. making a Jap flag because of the way the sheets look when you're finished? <laughs> oh, making a Japanese flag. Oh, making a Japanese flag. That's good, too, man. Little hey, what part, of yeah. what, what part of Virginia are you from? Haymarket. How far is that I've, from Falls Church? It's not far. Here it comes, I kids. I theater last time you were here, and I'm going to be there this time. Who's going to be with you? I, I, dude, I'm not even plugging that. The fact that I'm there June 25th is of no importance. I don't want anybody to even think about it. Yeah, but it's that? June 25th, right? Yeah, it's funny you should say that, Jim. It is. And, uh... Ticketmaster or 703-237-0300. What's that number again? Uh, yeah, Jesus, I, I, I'm Jim writing. I want to write it down. 703. These guys uh, know the game. 237. 237. 0300. 0300. That's great. What Ticketmaster? Whatever's convenient. I, I'm I'm probably gonna go. I go and I just I love you know doing stand up. It's so fun to go and watch. Stand up. <laughs> 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 you might as well get a nail driven in your head. You're like ah. Oh, you must go to comedy shows all the time. Every girl. I I mean, no, stupid. I never go to them. <laughs> All right, so Jim Norton's going to be there. And uh, it, before we take a break, Jim Gaffigan in the studio. And you're there promoting you a gig, improv, too. I'm, right? I'm at the improv tonight. Tonight. Mm -hmm. I'm just a journeyman. I'm not into the theater thing. What are you there? Tonight, tomorrow? Tonight do what? Uh, tonight, tomorrow, they uh, there's a there they added a show late Sunday. Oh, look at you. Nice. So there you go. So the people can come and yell O&A. &A. And what movie's you in? I, I got nothing. I popping up all over the place. I though. got nothing. Commercials? I I'm in some Sierra Mist commercials because I think yes. it's important to hoard yourself. Seen. And uh, mm -hmm. I love you know I didn't do the commercials for the money. I did it because I respect the product. <laughs> and I went out and I, I I mean I drink a lot of lemon lime soda. I really do. And Sierra Mist is a lot better. See? It's a lot better. And I was like you know what I'll do this for free. I'm the doing integrity. the commercials for free because yeah. I respect it. You know what I mean? And you uh, of course uh, one of the funniest roles in Super Troopers. The, the that meow is a guy. great uh, part go. of that. Movie. Well, thank you. No, I'm the Meow game. Yeah, it's 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 a uh, what an underrated everyone. movie. Like that is one of those cult movies. That, oh, that, it's a huge like, cult. You movie. watch it the first time and you find it really funny, but then you can watch it five more times. Yeah, it's, it's like raising Arizona. You're just like yeah. After like the fifth time, you're like ah. And it's it's the pothead movie. Like whenever yeah. people say I've seen that movie five times, you're like. So you smoke pot? Huh? Smoke pot. <laughs> like, oh, can you tell? I'm like, I don't know. You got enough time to watch that movie five times? That's very funny, though, that movie. It's all glamour. Yeah. It's all glamour. All right, we're going to take a quick break, and we'll continue with I Jim want to tinkle. Gaffigan. Yeah. Oh, again? Yeah, I go every again. break. Again, we've been talking for like an hour and a half straight here, I think. Rob, bitch. 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 Rob, bitch.